okay it's a day after thanksgiving and i'm gonna carve this turkey wasn't much eaten we sort of ate the ham we uh enjoyed the ham and the rose so and then I, I sent one turkey leg up to uh, Lance's brother, Kelvin. So that was all that was touched on the turkey. I may have sliced a little tiny piece of the breast right there that I tasted. But we, we really enjoyed the ham. Um, I didn't have company. I was really too tired. I went to sleep. And uh, I'm just going to show you how I'm going to carve this turkey. So far, I've taken off the leg and thigh. And on the other side, the thigh, minus the leg. The wing piece, just that little tip in and the other little joint part. And um, I'm going to take this part off here, the leg piece of the wing, and I'm going to sit it over here. Because I'm going to make turkey tetrazzini and uh, some turkey salad. I love good turkey salad after a turkey okay there's that other part of that wing and there's the leg part of the wing now I'm gonna take the breast and go down the middle and basically this is how you carve a turkey and go down there go in that little joint part right there and you got the breast one breast and you go on this other side And you get the other breast. And the wishbone should pop out. I say that I'm going to pull on it in a minute. Make a wish. So there's the other breast. And it's going to be left with the carcass now. Now, if this meat on the carcass, I'll probably take it off. I know I will take it off and add it to some turkey salad. I like dark meat in my turkey salad. So, I'll uh, pick pick on this and get it uh, ready for turkey salad. And I got Abby sitting here waiting in the wing for a piece of turkey. Here you go, Abby. Abby? Where well, she disappeared? I'm going to put it to the side for her. There she comes. I'm going to put this to the side for Abby. You really don't supposed to feed dogs turkey and chicken and all that, but I give them just a little piece. Little piece. They they actually supposed to eat raw meat, and uh, I read about that this morning in uh, in a newspaper. They supposed to eat raw meat, not cooked, and uh, they can't have tur turkey and chicken because it messes up their digestive system. And I'm I'm gonna sit that over there for every later on. There she go. Okay, there. Okay, let me rinse my hands. Glove up again. Okay. Let me go away for a minute and um, clean up my board. And then I'll show you how I'm going to slice the parts that I've taken out, off the turkey. Um, I only have one chopped board, so I need to clean this one up. So I will be right back.
Okay, I'm back, and uh, this is what I got off the carcass. So it was a pretty good little bit of meat there. And uh, I'm gonna chop, I've started chopping up on the leg part. And um, the leg to the wing. And uh, I'm putting the skin over that way and the bone and uh you don't have to you, you you cannot use skin i don't use skin and i pull the skin off and uh pull the bone off put the bone in and uh i'm gonna chop up the carved turkey that I have here and uh, I'll make a turkey salad I'll come back after I get through chopping up all my turkey and uh, I'll be right back okay good people I am back I have taken this turkey off the bone I've chopped it up this is what I'm gonna do for the turkey salad and this one I'm gonna do for turkey tetrazzini so I'm going to put this one up and I'm going to get on my way making my turkey salad okay about a half a cup of onion half a cup of celery Half a cup of bell pepper. My daughter does not like paste, don't like onions and bell pepper and celery and all that and chicken salad. If it ain't got that in it, then what is it? It ain't chicken salad. Okay. My pimentos. Let me drain a little bit more juice off of them. Okay, about a third cup of pimentos. Okay, I'm gonna put a tablespoon of sugar. About a teaspoon of celery seed. a teaspoon of accent about a teaspoon of salt about a tablespoon of salt black pepper I still haven't found my um white pepper but we're going to use black pepper about a tablespoon I'm going to put a thousand island dressing in it about a tablespoon tablespoon and a half and you can put any dressing in it you can put the Catalina in it you can put the um, uh, just any kind of dressing I, I sort of like flavorful stuff so I go ahead and put salad dressings in mine you can put Italian You can put honey mustard. Okay, about a tablespoon of ranch. A tablespoon and a half. Okay. About 
teaspoon of mustard. All right, let's go with a tablespoon. And I'm gonna put Duke's mayonnaise in it. Up one, two, three, about four good heapings of Duke's mayonnaise. My whole family like uh, chicken salad. We really like, we can't wait the day after cooking a turkey to uh, do a turkey salad. And you can put the white meat in, or the, or the dark meat, or even you can mix them up. You can put white and dark meat in it. Let me get another spoon to get some more mayonnaise. clear this jar out. I like a juicy turkey salad. I don't like mine dry. Okay, let me taste it, see if it's got, see if it needs anything else. Um, I'm gonna go with some more sugar. My family won't eat it now unless it's sweet. You don't have to put that much sugar in yours. You don't have to put sugar at all. Put about two tablespoons. And it's still too dry for me. And I'm going to put some more ranch. About another tablespoon of ranch. And I'm going to put another tablespoon of Thousand Island.
Okay, let me go in for another taste. That's still not sweet enough for me. Another tablespoon of sugar. I guess y'all say I'm gonna have diabetes. That's it. I don't know how much sugar I use, but that's it. That is it. It's good. Okay. I'm going to go away and I'm going to fix it up in a bowl and I'm going to fix me up a little plate and I'll be right back. Okay, this is the chicken salad that we made from the turkey we had yesterday. This is uh, some real good chicken salad, turkey salad. You can do turkey like this, you can do chicken like this, you can do ham like this. You don't have to only do turkey. So, uh, subscribe, like, comment to my video. And uh, don't forget to hit the notification bell. It lets you know when I'm coming out with more videos. Uh, I'm going to show you my plate that I have fixed for myself. Let me put this right over here. And this is my plate that I have done for myself. I am going to have a ball eating this. I got three little scoops, a few crackers, tomatoes, um, some uh, sliced cheese, and I've got this white cheese right here. This uh, uh, pepper jack cheese. Oh, my I'm fixing to get busy in just a minute. Y'all, um, stay humble. Please be blessed. Stay blessed. And y'all have a good day. And y'all don't have to go home. But you gotta get out of here. Bye for now.